The State Theater in downtown Sioux Falls celebrated its 95th birthday last week. Carol and Sophie Heineman is taking us inside the building to see the newly restored theater and finding out what moviegoers can expect. The balcony is not restored yet. When you step inside the State Theater in downtown Sioux Falls, you'll quickly feel as though you traveled back in time. Executive Director Allison Wyland says the carefully made restorations were no easy feat. It's hard to look at a photograph from 1926 and get, you know, your color scheme. So we bring in experts. They came in and they went throughout the theater and they peel back the layers of paint to find what the original colors were. The theater also recently marked its 95th birthday, and to celebrate, guests were welcomed with another piece of history, a showing of the first film to ever play in the theater, Behind the Front. People were kind of excited to see uh, a good old uh, silent film with an organ track to it, uh, and kind of reminisce and uh, or think of what it would have been like in 1926 to, to be in this theater. General Manager Stephen Dahlmeyer says seeing moviegoers' reaction to 10 years of hard work is the biggest reward. Since opening in December, the theater has had great attendance. In addition to the restoration, seats like this may be one of the attractions bringing people in. <laughs> Along with new seating, the theater is revamped with new technology and specially built speakers to give guests an experience to remember. The touches that we did, we tried to blend in uh, to make sure that the historic character of the building was the most prominent feature. We don't want technology or you know, some of the modern touches to be the main focal point. We want you to come in and, and notice the plaster work and notice the, the stencil detail on the ceiling. I think people are coming to see the movie. Uh, you know, we've upgraded all the systems. It's a great experience, but I think they're also um, getting the ticket to come and see the theater restored. The doors open to the public in December of 2020 with COVID precautions in place. Even with pandemic-related challenges, Dahlmeyer says business is going well. We have a lot of COVID rules in place with uh, social distance seating, mask requirements, and so uh, we'll keep those in place until it's safe to remove those. Uh, but people have been comfortable coming here. In Sioux Falls, Sophie Heineman, Kelloland News.